uh, years ago we wanted to get into farming, and so I'm one of the. I, I am a first generation farmer, and that uh, I looked at what the alternatives were, and that. Um, if you're going to be a medium-sized farm, you need to find your niche, and that we found our niche in growing cherries and blueberries. And that, um, that when you start trying to grow cherries in this part of California, anyway, that um, what you find really fast is that the lack of winter chilling uh, affects the fruit set. And so, um, what we've kind of discovered down here is that we just can't grow cherries without using Dormex. I don't think any grower is more aware of of climate change than cherry growers because we're seeing unprecedented warm winters and winters without valley fog. Historically, we would have 30 days where the valley would be in a fog belt, and that these days, without the rain, we're just not seeing the fog, and we're seeing warmer temperatures. We're seeing radiant light, and uh, you know, as a result, that it's getting harder and harder to set crops. Um, you know, the last two years have been difficult for cherry growers to set crops. Last three years, actually, and that uh, certainly all of the all of the orchards that are having fruit, that you know, are using Dormex, and the ones that are not, you know, are considering other crops to grow.